Years of work ends with a big old celebration today. Fans and players mark the opening of the Pfizer Forum with one seriously huge fiesta. I know, 50,000 people <laughs> registered for today's grand opening block party. Fox 6 was there. Our Caitlin Sharkey is going to fill you in on the players who are going to enjoy the arena in a moment. Yeah, that's right. But Theo Keith leading our coverage tonight with today's ceremony, and it was a packed one. Yeah, Mary, I don't know if all 50,000 showed up, but many thousands of people did. Well, suffice it to say that this was a chance for the public to see what it paid for. There is hope that this building will help deliver something that the Bucks have not had in nearly a half century, and that's an NBA championship. The Bucks owners, star Giannis Antetokounmpo and legend Kareem Abdul-Jabbar cut a ribbon outside Pfizer Forum, officially opening the team's $524 million home. Thousands of fans waded through an hour of speeches from politicians and the Bucks owners. They were excited when they finally got to see what's inside. It's more modern day, it's more appealing. Yeah, it's pretty good. I like the way the court looks. NBA Commissioner Adam Silver, who endorsed a new arena instead of moving the Bucks to a new city, called the public and private financing for this facility remarkable. I think everyone understood, even if the team had stayed in Milwaukee, um, in order to compete in the NBA, the team needed a new arena. After a debate at the state capitol in 2015, taxpayers put up $250 million for the project. Team owner Wes Eden said he never had any doubt that the arena would get built. I really thought it was so much the right answer for the organization and for the city and for the state that we would get to the right place. Abdul Jabbar says there's never been this much excitement around the Bucks, and he was on the 1971 NBA championship team. The Bradley Center was a fine place, but it, it wasn't uh, distinctly better than everything else. This venue was like awesome. The team also renamed the new plaza outside the arena as Herb Cole Way. Cole, the former team owner, put up $100 million of his own money toward this project. The first event is a rock concert, The Killers, on September 4th. Back to you. The killer